So this will be our fourth video from Chiman, uh, about four miles from the Afghan border. And this first picture is a Muslim man who's gotten a copy of both books. And this is a copy of the picture of a woman is getting these copies of the book. She had been a Hindu and six years ago received Jesus. And now she's asking for copies and receiving prayer for more of her family, other heads of Hindu families to spread the word. And then you can see in this picture and the next several pictures, the joy in the faces of those existing Christians getting supplemental uh, works and assistance. Uh, the, the truth, the Bible verses in these books can condensed to show them the plan of salvation from Genesis to Revelation, God's heart to evangelize the lost through the whole of the Bible. And then, of course, anybody that's dealing with sickness in their world or themselves can find divine health and healing in every book of the Bible from Genesis to Revelation. And it's just a joy to see that three-pronged attack, uh, you know, wisdom strategy, uh, reach the Muslims, reach the Hindus, and then uh, supplement and encourage the Christians that are already there. And so you guys are helping us do that. Appreciate your prayers. We can put faces with places and be able to lift them up to you. This is um, an area controlled by the Taliban. You'll see in some of these pictures coming up, there are actually Taliban flags flying just down the street from the local police station. This is in Pakistan, not Afghanistan. Uh, I'll let you do the math on that. But this is an area that's uh, heavily um, fortified uh, through prayer the last few days, at least, uh, against the demons of darkness and the uh, intrusions of those kinds of things. Uh, some good news in the face of, there's the local police station, in the face of what you've been seeing on the, the nightly news, secular news, there's the Taliban flag uh, unashamedly flying on the top of that building. And then you'll see another picture of, picture of it here in just a second. And there, our team is driving by and seeing the Taliban on the streets, snapping the pictures of the flags to just kind of show you um, you know, I wouldn't, don't want to say dangerous. I mean, in the natural, yeah, but the safest place on earth is right in the middle of the will of God, no matter where you are. And they are in the will of God. And so we believe they are safe and protected. And I uh, was up late last night praying for them and, and um, they were greatly appreciative. So they sensed a lot of favor on their time there. And I can see that with um, the number of homes they were allowed into and the church services, impromptu church services. You can see the next generation here getting the books. Um, it, that girl right there would be, if she were in Afghanistan, she would be snatched up by the Taliban to be a child bride. And so God is protecting her, and we're very grateful for that. And, um, you know, it's just an amazing opportunity that we have here.